Days after this tree slammed into a South Buffalo home, little has been done. These images show the tree still laying right there, and the homeowner tells us tonight getting it down has simply become a nightmare. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Rachel Elzavon explains. Imagine this scene at your house, not for one or two, but five days. We're just hitting walls. No, no one can get this tree down right now. Nicole Kozlowski owns the Buffalo home, but the tree came from a neighbor's yard, and neighbors say it's been dead since the 90s and should have been cleared years ago. It seems like it's all coming back on me because the tree is on my house, but it wasn't up to me to upkeep this tree. But now no. the homeowner is on the hook for the damage because the owner of the fallen tree does not have homeowners in insurance and that's not breaking the law. An insurance company tells me homeowners insurance is recommended but not required in New York. Ultimately, it's up to the lender. My tenant has children. Um, my dad could have been in the yard here. I, anything could have happened and then whose responsibility would it have been? The city says it can issue a fine to the owner for not doing anything about the dead tree, but it can't force the owner to take action. And the tree is so rotted, removal companies are hesitant to touch it, fearing more damage to the house. We can't get any contractors here until the tree is removed, so we have no idea what kind of expenses we're looking at at this point. Right now, the Kozlowski still don't have an answer as to who else could be responsible for bringing that tree down. They hope it will be removed soon, though. In Buffalo, Rachel Alzafon 7, Eyewitness News.